Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm so excited to bring you the new Ipsy Glam Bag Plus um, unboxing. Now, <laughs> me and Ipsy are not on good terms right now. I did today just receive my July Glam Bag. And uh, what is it, August 8th? Is it August 8th? Yes, it is. So I'm a little upset about that. Um, I reached out to them twice because uh, the first time I was told after 15 days they would send a replacement. They did not. <laughs> uh, they kept saying it was on the way. They gave me points. And then, you know, I think last week I had reached out to them again and they said, oh, well, it's still on the way. And they shipped it on July 7th. And I just got it today. I am not happy with that. I don't know what happened. Um, I, I'm a little peeved with Ipsy right now. So I did receive August Glam Bag Plus a little bit early. So I'm happy with that. Um, they have a new way that they are doing it. I think you can choose, what was it, like three products now instead of just one. So I'm curious to see uh, how this is going to work out for me. So. Before we get started, if you guys are not subscribed, please go ahead and hit that button down below. I would love to have you. You can also follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, TikTok, all that good stuff. And I will have those all listed down below for you. So let's see what the month of August has for us in this Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. So right away, I do know, notice that the bag is bigger. It's not a box. The first thing I see is not in our bag. It is the Complex Culture plush powder. I'm assuming it's a brush. So let's see what this bad boy looks like. No. Oop, no. <laughs> yeah, that is a very, very nice brush. Now I've received um, a brush from this brand a couple months back, I think it was, and I actually really, really enjoy it. I think they are very well made. They're super soft. So I'm very happy to have this in my bag. All right, the next item I have is also not in her bag because obviously this is going to be too big to fit in. This is the, actually, let me go ahead and unbag this real fast. Bubble wrap. Who else here loves bubble wrap? Oh. <laughs> this is not your typical bubble wrap. It's like, so satisfying. Okay, sorry. Uh, so this is the Bailey Saran Estate Palette. I don't know who any of those people are, the brand or the person. <clears throat> so the packaging is still the same. And ooh, that's really, really, really pretty. Look at those colors. Should we do a swatch? That purple? Oh, that purple is so freaking pretty. My eye goes straight to that purple. All right, let's go ahead and do a couple swatches. Yeah, it's a little dry, but that doesn't mean anything. Let's go ahead and do that gold and this orangish color. And why not? Let's just go ahead and do this shimmer shade too. All right, so there are your shades right there. Very pretty. makes me happy oh that's pretty oh that one's a little uh, a little so-so and then oh yeah okay so the shimmer shades swatched really really nicely um, I got to I went back over just a little bit and that ended up being okay so I will actually have to play around with this and uh, yeah, we'll see what I can create with it. All right, so this is the bag this month. I actually think it's really, really cute. I like that it's a drawstring bag. Um, I could see myself reusing this in the future, so I don't know if this is how it's gonna be from now on. I do like the fact that Ipsy is like all shimmery lettering, lettering <laughs> excuse me. Um, I think that's really cute, but let's see what else we got. Oh, I see like three more products. Okay, so the first item we have is Beauty For Real. It's like a two-in-one. Let's see what this is. Um, 
shadow sticks. Oh, these are eyeshadows. How cool. Okay. So. All right. Oh, those are very, very pretty. I don't think I've ever had like shadow sticks before. So. Oh, that's super creamy. That would be a really nice brow bone highlight one. That's super, super creamy. Can you see them? Like this one right here. This one would definitely be a really good brow bone highlight. I don't really know about that one, but uh, they seem really, really creamy. Okay, that's interesting. That's definitely uh, something that I haven't purchased before. Something that I could see myself using. So very happy with this. All right, the next item we have is from Ciante London. This is their Triple Shot XXL Mascara. Very happy to have this. I've had their Wanderlust mascara, I think that's the name of it. I'm not really sure. I've used it several times before. I love that mascara, especially for my lower lash line. So very excited to have this. I haven't tried this one. Um, let's see what the wand looks like. Oh yeah, that's definitely right up my alley. I actually like this kind of applicator um, where it's smaller on the end and it kind of widens as it goes um, on down that helps me get a little bit closer to my inner corner so super excited with that and we have two more items in here I think one was uh, one that I purchased I can't remember which one was which okay so these are Huda Beauty Demi Matte Lipsticks now I know I purchased one as an add-on and the other one actually was a choice I think it was um, so I think this one was the choice. So this is Day Slayer. Now I do have a video swatching every single shade that the Huda Beauty line has in their Demi Matte selection. So if you want to see other colors that they have, uh, you can definitely go check out that video. I have it linked right up here in the corner for you. And uh, be kind because that was my first ever swatch video. So this is really pretty packaging. I love the way that this feels. I think it's very luxurious feeling. So Day Slayer. I think this is definitely one of the nudes that I, I actually really enjoyed. Oh yeah, that is so pretty. Oh, very, 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 very happy with that. And the other shade is, what is it? Feminist? I think this one was definitely a little bit more on the pink side, but still a really pretty shade. Okay, not as pink as I thought it would, just another nude. So that makes me happy. <laughs> All right, so there are the two shades. All these colors, I love colors like this. So this actually makes me extremely happy. Okay, so it does give you a card that explains a little bit more how they're gonna be doing the new Ipsies. Uh, for regular Ipsy, you get to pick two personali personalized items. Um, I guess if it's Ipsy Plus, you get to choose three of the foot, uh, three out of the five full size um, items and up to eight additional add-on products. Okay, um, that's exciting. So let's do a quick recap of this month's bag. So we got the um, Estate palette, which is really, really pretty. There is definitely some good shades in here, um, like that purple. But I'm actually excited to try this out. Eyeshadow palettes are definitely one of my first loves. So with that being said, of course, this would make me happy. We have the complexion like blush brush, um, powder brush, whatever. It doesn't matter. I can use it as anything I want. <laughs> but this is a very, very nice quality brush. Um, very durable. Super, super soft. So I'm really happy to have this in here. We have the Ciate London Triple Shot Extra Extra Large Mascara. Excited to have this in here once again because this is a brand that I love. The Huda Beauty Demi Matte Lipstick, which I did not own one. I actually only had uh, samples when I was doing the swatches. So super excited that this is in here because I really love the way that they felt. They had beautiful shades. So... I think that one makes the bag for me. Uh, and then we have the eyeshadows, which I think is really, really cool because I haven't had like eyeshadow sticks before. They're really, really pretty shades. That one I definitely would use as like a brow bone highlight. Um, so yeah, I'm actually really happy with this month. I'm so glad it got here um, for me to review for you guys because a month <laughs> 
is just a little bit too long for an Ipsy bag. So uh, yeah, and of course I had the little add-on of so I have two Dibby Matte Huda Beauty lipsticks. Alright guys, so that is it for this unbagging. I hope you really enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a big ol' thumbs up and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye!